Hello, welcome back. So let's see if we can finish up channel with age here in two videos. So I've got the blue I've got the red page and uh I should probably by this point go and, and go back to Mist and try to see if I could free Cirrus with this page. Um, he might just need just this one page to get out. I have no, I have no idea. I would have no idea at this point. Well, what is this? Wow, freaky. That kind of looked like Agnar there. Alright, some kind of torture device. Alright. Let's, uh, let's go in here. This leads to another cabin. I'm going to assume that this is Akinar's cabin. Oh look, there's a blue page laying on the ground. What is this? Okay, so this is some kind of imager that looks like Akinar uses to just to display his face in certain parts of the area. Probably to, I don't know, scare people. Let's see what this one does. This guy Akinar is very troubled. <laughs> I would I think if even if this was my first playthrough of Mist, I would help Cirrus every time. By the way, the same actor who plays Akinar also plays Atris, Rand Miller. It's a nice little nugget of information. I hope I push the right button. Very interesting device, brother. I'm not erasing anything important, am I? <laughs> he is preparing. Remember, take only one page. So it looks like Cirrus knew this was happening and recorded himself um, giving the person a precaution. That is very odd. I never understood how Cirrus kind of knew. I guess he knew that... I don't know. Maybe if you guys put it in the comments below, you can kind of describe that. I find it hard to believe that Cirrus, while he's free, would know that uh, the person only had to take one page. And by the way, that's actually uh, Robin Miller. That's actually Rand Miller's brother, uh, the guy who plays Atris in all the Mist games. All right, so let's let's get back to Mist and uh, give put this page in the red book and see if we can release. All right. So it's becoming dark. Let's hurry up and get out of here before it gets too dark and we can't see where we're going. Oh my god, I'm going to be sick. I'm going to be sick. Alright. Okay. So, we discovered earlier... Uh, we already found the mist book, so let's, uh, let's redirect the energy back to that one elevator. Alright, so... Yeah, I can't see anything anymore. Thank god I have this flashlight. Alright, so... Let's redirect the water. Okay, that works. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Yeah, yeah, I need to redirect the water yet again. Yeah, there's no more water here. Ah! That 
leads to that dead end pipe. See, this is so much harder when it's dark. <laughs> All right, so okay, so I don't care about that. Here we go. I don't hear the water here either. So let's go back here. Yeah, here we go. Here's here's the spot right here. Okay, so it's going there, it's going this direction. Here we go, this is the one I want. Okay, so that is leading over there? Yes. Can't see anything. Okay. Alright. And let's get the hell out of here. Oh, gosh. <laughs> This sucks out so dark I can't even see it until it's like right up on top of me. Alright. It really is nifty to know how there's a, uh, a day night cycle on these islands. I really do like that. Alright, so we can hear the water coming to this area. So we know this is being powered. Alright, got the red page. I will not be coming back here for the blue page. I guess you could do that for, for both. Just to see what both of them say, but... Uh. Alright. Now that resembles the ceiling in the library. So I know this takes me back to mist. Okay, so. Alright. Return. Thank you for bringing me back. You're welcome. You must continue to help. Oh, I will. Also insane from what I can see. And I wrongfully imprisoned. Bring the red page to me. Okay, so what I gather from that is that uh, I need to bring him more red pages, and um, not to help his brother, which his brother seems rightfully insane. He seems, you know, fairly insane, so I will not be helping him. So, by using this tower rotation, um, we will move on. Uh, let's do this one, this uh, cog, which by reading in this book, which also matched that symbol, uh, I know that this is called the Mechanical Age. We read about it in this book. Um, all right, so let's go check out uh, the information for this. Actually. To save time, because I've already seen, I've played this game so much, I already know what 
the code is and everything. So basically you go in there and it gives you the time that you need to put on that massive clock right there. Um, and another number, which you have no idea what it does. But we will discover that in the next video, guys. See ya.